Let's have a look at their opposition, the Storm lineup, and they've got some changes here. Justin Ollum, a lot of people were calling for him to come back into the team, and Craig Bell Bellamy has answered. Smith, Remus Smith moves to the wing. So in saying that, they've got some a, a couple of really good players that come in back in, into this squad after that loss last week against the Brisbane Broncos, and they were hammered. They were hammered, pillar to post, not even in the ball game. But as Gordy said earlier, there's no better team that bounces back better than the Melbourne Storm. Do we just expect that to happen this week? I do. Yeah, I really do. Uh, back at home. Um, and, and everything that you've just spoken about, Braith, the, the fact that we don't see that type of performance from the Melbourne Storm and they'll, they would be hurting they, and, 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 and they'd be peed off with themselves. Right? And that, that's, there's no greater motivator than when you know within yourself you're playing poor and you've got one last chance to go and prove it. Um, the players they're bringing in, they're, they're, they're capable NRL players and, and proven they, NRL players. Not only are they capable, I would argue that they're probably... But they're, they add more. Like, well, Olam at his Olam best and does. Remus Coach Smith... is a big loss. You're sorry, you're, yeah, you got me there. That, that's, a, that's definite. Coach is a huge loss. But Remus Smith has held his own the last couple of years. Just, Justin Olam's had 33 tackle busts in 15 games this but year. But it's not that defensively, those halves, yeah. without too Meters. much to go to, yeah. the pressure that he's going to put on... The Roosters' halves, if they're going to go to the line, I think Olam's going to put a lot of pressure. Mm. So he's going to, you know I mean? And then there was a couple of soft tries for Melbourne Storm. They don't normally let, you know, the Katoni Stags and the Reese Wall shooter waltz through like that. You think mm. Olam. And, and keep, in mind, keep in mind with Olam, he's been dropped for a reason. He's been down on his form. Yeah. Craig Bellamy's been disappointed with the way he's been playing. So he comes back, not just because. You know, you've been surplus to needs as far as being chosen in first grade or reserve grade. You know, you've been poor. Come back to the NRL with a point to prove. Mm. And that's, that's got to be frightening. Mm. I have no doubt in the world the big guns for the Storm, Munster, Hughes and Grant, they won't play as bad as they did last week. The concern, though, is that I just think that the Broncos forward certainly exposed the Storm pack. The Storm didn't have a bloke that ran over 100 metres. I think Nelson got about 95 and he was by far the most. And he's starting on the bench again. And the Roosters forwards have been yeah. going gangbusters. Mm. So I reckon if the Roosters have a chance, they're, they're, they're gonna, that's where they'll lead the yeah. way, which is only going to make it harder for the, the big three to stand up. No, I agree. Their, their forward pack's got to really deliver this week. And if they want their, their spine to bounce back and be better than last week,